Hello, brothers and sisters. I'm back in my granny's, granny's sister's house where I used to live with her. She used to sleep there and these was the... I used to live here with her in this space. And um, these was the, this was the time of my life where I understand that um, the spiritual realm is real where Lord uh, revealed to me that uh, how carefully we need to use our tongues and with who and what we are speaking things and what kind of things we are speaking. So we need to use wisely our tongue. I just want to have a prayer before I leave this place. I need to leave keys. I packed here everything. The thing's going to be thrown out, so I'm going to have a little prayer before I leave this place. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for revealing all the secrets and the things of this world, the truth. You are mighty. That Every day I'm walking here and understanding things in the planet here on earth, I understand that you are real. You are not a joke. And the people around me and people who are with me and around me, they need to see the glorious things that you have been done. As the book of Romans are saying, the people for themselves are refusing. They are, there is no excuse for them to say that they didn't know that you are real. There is no excuse of the things that you are showing. Your might is showing from the, from the beginning, beginning of the times. Your, your might, your power, your realness, your, your truth, your love is revealed here on planet Earth. It, it is within, within, within us. We are part of you. The spirit that we have, it is coming from you. This is the very gift from you, Father. So, the may, so may the truth be shown. May the truth and love be shown from your kingdom, from your throne, Father. May the, in midst of us, your kingdom reveals from the prayers in the spirit, the prayers in walking in the spirit. Father, pre, please reveal right now in the spirit what I need to do in the next, in the next weeks, in the next time, in the future. Father, please be with me right now in Jesus' name. Father, reveal your power and might right now here. Father, thank you that you showed the power of yourself right here in this room, very room where I'm standing here. You came to to me you 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 saved us me and me, me and granny you saved her you saved me your spirit came into us and you showed jesus your love through the holy spirit you show that you are real you revealed the things that we needed to see father please right now in the name of the jesus christ loosen the spirits that are around me to blockages me to put in the blockages and they're coming in the spirit they're coming in the spirit to discern distract me to block me to do the things that the so they i, I can't pray in the spirit they want to steal my 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 anointing they want to steal my purpose that you put it uh, you put it from the end uh, from the uh, from the start of the times you put it for me father please right now in a spirit father reveal me to things that i need to know and understand your might and your power to that is inside me father please please forgive me father for the things that i've done and i'm being ignorant and being being selfish, Father, that I'm being rude and being angry sometimes, Father, please reveal more and more the things that I need to understand, how to fight back against the, against the spirits that are coming against me to stop me and block me by, by praying you and glorifying you and praising you so that the word of, you, word of your, your truth and your love can be shown to others, Father, so I can bring the truth more and more, Father, so I'm not being discouraged and being brave. Let me, Father, be brave. Let me be not be ashamed of your word and your might and your power. In Jesus' name, Father, bring your spirit right now in the midst of this place so I can feel and understand you more and more. Thank you, Father, that you've been here and you saved Granny and you saved my family. I know that you are coming for us. Father, please reveal your things. Save us, Father, from the anger, from the evil that is in, within us and around us. What is inside this plant in this, in this, is containing in this world, Father, Thank you that you are with us. Thank you that you are mighty with us, that you are showing your power and might, Father. I want to obtain the things and secrets that I need to know and the love and the, and the courage and, and the meekness and, and the fruits of the Holy Spirit, Father. Please reveal the thing, things that I need to know. Father, give me that sword in Jesus' name so I can fight back every single demon and principality or the powers of this uh, this world, who are evilness that is in this world, what is around me, that is trying to block me, trying to steal the things what is inside me, Father. What you gave me, the blessings that you gave me, Father, they, like, may they multiply. 
May the, the, spirit, the fruits of this Holy Spirit multiply in my life so I can bring the glory to your, to your name, Father. I don't want to earn the points and, 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 and your love. I want to understand how to, how to show to others your might, Father, so they can come closer to you and re understand that you are real, that you are loving, loving God. You are, you are, ple you, you are, you are praiseworthy. You are glory worthy for everything that you are doing. Thank you for me. Thank you. Thank you, Father, that you saved me from the death, that you brought me on my hand, on your hands, me, Father, that you, you let me go through everything in my life through with the, with the, with the faith in you father sorry that i gave up father and i know you forgive me everything release the heaviness from my soul from my heart and from my brain from my from my mind from my from my body from every single molecule and every vibe in my body father release it right now in a jesus mighty name father release it all release it father brothers and sisters don't be discouraged don't be discouraged, please. Keep fighting, good fight, no matter what. Whatever kind of thoughts are coming in your mind, this is coming from your. This is coming from your, from the spirits that are in assignment to stop you from praying, stopping, stopping from loving the God's word, stopping you from understanding Lord and being with Him and talking with Him every day more and more. Don't be discouraged. Love your enemies. No matter what, forgive your enemies. No matter what is happening in your life, you gotta do mistakes. There are gonna be mistakes, but by by taking by taking in cap in captivity every thought and your actions and 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 putting yourself in the discipline of the Holy Spirit, you can overcome. We need to overcome, Father. Give us strength to overcome things in the spirit that is coming against us. What is inside us? What is still not cleansed from our hearts and bodies? Thank you, Father. Thank you, dear Lord, Heavenly Father. Thank you for everything. May praises and glory go straight to your throne, Father. Look down from the throne right now and look to us and, and help us, Father. We need you. We really need you, Father. No matter what is happening, I'm going to keep still praying to you. I'm going to still walk in the Spirit. I want to walk in the Spirit. I'm no, I want to know you more. I want to speak with you more. I want to, I want to know you better right here in this room here. First three or four months as I was praying here.